Hi everyone, MPTV is here today. If you are looking for a freehold development, something slightly newer, and you are prefer more privacy than a facility, then we are the only option available for you right here at the central residence. Today, we have a two different layout units, one plus one bader, 1,087 square feet, and the other one, three plus one bathers, size at 1,787 square feet. Before we check it out the unit, we are currently at the top floor of the building. As you can see, we are having the two different infinity pool facing toward the KL City skyscraper. Imagine, in the night view, you can have this beautiful scene of it. So, let's check it out at the facility. Before we dive right into the unit itself, let us just talk a little bit more about this development. The location of Central Residence is only a mere 7 to 8 minutes away from the KL Central Transportation Hub, which consists of MRT, LRT, KTMB and KLIA Express that can bring us around the KL City area. Access to Central Residence is however excellent via Jalan Damasara, Jalan Dun Sambatan, Jalan Sae Putra and Jalan Istana. If you were to pull up the site plan right now, Central Residence consists of two blocks, come with 55 storeys, total of 752 units, split among one bader, one plus one bader, two bathers, three plus one, and four bathers. So let us dive into the unit right now. All the units in Central Residence, it come with its own personal lift lobby. Now, this is the foyer area. Once you exit from the lift, you will notice the flooring is actually come with the marble flooring, starting from the lift lobby towards the whole entire unit. For this much of a foyer area space, you can have additional storage to store away all your clutter or get a shoe cabinet built in, which I believe all the ladies love to do so. We are here at the 1 plus 1 bader, size at 1087 square feet. What welcome you to this unit is a 10 feet tall height of a ceiling. And once you enter the unit, right hand side will be the kitchen area. It comes with an L shaped kitchen countertop with a gas stove and an oven. Hey, your lunch, uh? As we move toward to the kitchen area, you will notice the owner has built this hidden fridge to increase the storage space. To factor the washer and the dryer, the owner also built in the top cabinet, hanger and a sliding door to cover up when you want to hang up your clothes. Most of the study area, they do not come with a windows. But for this study, it is slightly different because you also can have a view to overlooking towards the horizon. This is definitely a great size for you to place your study table. But otherwise, if you say your family is expanding, you want to convert it into a second bedroom, which you can do so. I think in terms of the size for a study area, this is definitely a very generous. Now, move toward to the master bedroom. It is currently fitted with a king-size bed, and you still have a place to put on a sofa and a dressing table over there. What I love the most for this uni layout is this walk-in wardrobe. It is currently fitted with a two-side full-height wardrobe. Moving toward to the master bathroom, you will realise the size is very generous as well. You can have a standing shower area and a big bathtub separately. For me, I will just soak in into this big bathtub after a long day work. Now, as we're heading over to the living area, you will notice you have a good span of distance away from the sitting sofa towards the TV console. Currently, this area you are fitted in a 3 to 4 seater. Now, that's all for this unit. Let me show you another unit. Let's go. Just now was a one plus one bader unit. So right now, let me show you a bigger unit layout, which is three plus one bathers, size as 1,787 square feet. Once you enter the unit, right hand side will be your powder room, which is easy for your guests to use it. Move toward to the kitchen area. You will see there's a lot of space for your kitchen utensil and kitchen stock. You will realize the owner also investing here the hidden fridge 
to increase the storage space for you. It does come with the L-shaped kitchen countertop, similar with the previous smaller unit, but longer. Come, move forward to the yard area. Owner also converted it into the wet kitchen area. Of course, the windows over there is good for your ventilation purpose when you have a cooking over here. Behind of this yard area, there's a plus one room, which you can use it for the mid room or either to convert it into a utilities room. All right, let me show you the second bedroom in this unit. It currently fitted with a queen size bed and a full high wardrobe over here. And you still have a plenty of space for you to put on a working desk or a dressing table over here. Not to mention all the room in this unit layout, it come with an attached bathroom. Come right across over here, you will have a smaller bedroom in this unit layout. It currently fitted with a single bed and a wardrobe as well. If you wish to convert this into a study area, which you can do so, you can place a working desk over here and you still have plenty of space to move around. Moving forward to the master bedroom, you can easily fit in a super king size bed over here. Still ample space for you to put a two side table over here and you still have a space for you to maneuver around with a very nice window watching the second tallest building in the world, PMB118. Over here, this is the six door full high wardrobe and this is the master bathroom. I think in terms of the size, it's very good enough because you still have a big bathtub and a standing shower area separately. It's great to see there's a window over here because it does help to dispel a lot of moisture out. Moving towards to the dining area, a six-seater dining set has been placed over here. And for the living area, it's spacious enough for you to fit in a five to six-seater sofa. From the windows view, you can enjoy the unblocked horizon view of KL City, same as the master bedroom. Alright, we have come to the end of today's home tour. If you like these two properties or any other units in Central Residence, do give me a call or click the link below. Remember, like and subscribe to our channel. My name is Hans Yong, signing off.